Yeah, I think Colin Kaepernick, nobody's going to remember his his career as a football player in terms of specifics, but everybody's going to remember the knee. Uh, Colin has had a dramatic impact on this society. People are going to talk about Colin Kaepernick when they talk about Tommy Smith and John Carlos and Arthur Ashe and Muhammad Ali. And one of the white players was hurling the N-word at the black player for the first three days of the camp till I finally challenged. The guy literally knocked me out cold. Well, the black guy's name at the time was Lou Alcinder, became Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And a lifelong friendship began that uh, it was so profound that when Kareem had his statue unveiled at the Staples Center, he asked me to speak at it. I was one of his two guests with Henry Louis Gates at the White House when he got the Presidential Medal of Freedom from Barack Obama. 10.45, there was a knock on the door, and I assumed it was the campus security. Uh, so I didn't hesitate to open the door. And when I opened the door, instead it was two men wearing stocking masks who proceeded to cause liver damage, kidney damage, a hernia concussion, and carved the N-word in my stomach with a pair of office scissors. 